There are new concerns tonight about your privacy. We often talk about social media as a possible threat. Tonight, something you might not have considered, your own body. Correspondent Jillian Turner explains. Do you have a history of breast cancer in your family? I realized I don't know on my biological father's side. That was ultimately what drove me to sign up. After years on the market as a specialty product, consumer DNA testing has now gone mainstream. With $99 million in sales last year for companies like 23andMe, Ancestry, and MyHeritageDNA. That market's poised to boom. Financial analysts predict $310 million in sales in 2022. More people than ever are eager to learn what their genes say about them. Your genetic information is in some ways some, like the most foundational part of you. But customers may not be prepared to share that highly personal information with third-party companies, something 23andMe plans to do. Announcing this week a $300 million deal with pharma giant GlaxoSmithKline to use people's DNA to develop medical treatments. The deal gives Glaxo access to 23andMe's genetic database of nearly 5 million customers in order to focus on research and development of innovative new medicines and potential cures using human genetics as the basis for discovery. But security experts say there's nothing more personal than your own DNA data, and it's unethical for companies to sell or otherwise use it without your consent. They did not realize that a service that they paid for and something as personal and unique as their DNA could be sold and profited upon. Consumers and some states have alerted the Federal Trade Commission to privacy concerns, and insiders believe the agency is already investigating these companies' data sharing policies. This could be used in the future potentially against you. It could be used to deny you a loan, potentially health insurance. There are currently no federal requirements that DNA testing companies inform customers about security breaches that expose their personal data. But some lawmakers want DNA testing to have the same proposed privacy regulations as social media. Would you support a rule uh, that would require you to notify your users of a breach within 72 hours? Senator, that makes sense to me. Security experts say it's imperative the government take action quickly. They warn cyber criminals are already finding creative ways to use stolen DNA data to defraud Americans. Brett? Interesting story. Jillian, thank you.